everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Hello, hi, I'm Katie and welcome back if you're a subscriber. You are the best. You literally are the best if you are subscribed. And if you're not subscribed, then please consider joining our Good Vibe Tribe if you enjoyed today's video. It's a little bit of a different one for me today. I feel like some of the pieces might actually surprise you guys if you are um, a returning subscriber, if you're part of the Good Vibe Tribe. You'll be like, oh, that's a bit different, Katie. But actually, I really, really like it. And I think it's really good to challenge your style sometimes and try things that you're not sure of even if you just buy them to try them on you can always send them back so i think it's really really good yeah just to like push yourself a little bit outside of your style comfort zone shall we say um and definitely just try something new because you never know you might love it um which has been the case for a few things for me today so let's get straight into today's top shop haul um i've got some lovely like i said lovely bits to share with you so i'm really actually really excited about this one um also make sure you're following me over on instagram i'm at with love katie and two underscores and i share daily fashion inspo over there and if you're excited for today's video hit that little thumbs up button give it a little thumbs up if you're a silent subscriber leave me a little comment you know just say hey be like hey i'm so and so and i'm from here in the world just just say hi it's just really nice to receive comments, that's all. If you appreciate my videos and you've never ever said hello, I would really appreciate that back. As a little thank you, as I'm sure you do know, a lot of work goes into these videos. Um, so yes, today's Topshop haul is a good one. Let's get straight into it. They obviously have some Black Friday sales. I'm not sure um, if they'll still be on by the time this video is up, but they have got some great bargains. And I know if you download the app, you do get a discount code as well for downloading the app. So there's a little bit of savings for you there. I'm going to start with this jumper. This jumper has been, I think this may be one of my favourite pieces from the haul. It's a really simple black jumper, but there's so much going on at the same time. So it's absolutely gorgeous. It's got this bottom ribbed detail. It's very cinched in at the waist, which is obviously great for showing off the, the hourglass figure. It's got a little um, collar around the neckline, which I just love. And it's actually like a two collar collar if that makes sense and um, i got it in a size medium i'm a uk size 12 and i'm five foot nine just for your guys's reference because you always seem to ask um and i generally am a uk 12 so that's what size fits me most of the time um so yeah or i normally get a medium and things and it fits nicely too um on bottoms i normally get a large because i got a big booty um, but yeah, this is just a really lovely ribbed, thin, everyday sort of jumper. And this could easily, easily be worn in, in like the house for like loungewear with a nice pair of black joggers like these ones I got on here. Or it could be worn really nicely as well for like with some black jeans, some black boots. So it's really, really smart. Dress it up, a little blazer over the top for like a shopping trip. Again, or you could definitely dress it up in so many different ways. Um, like a nice midi skirt, nice floaty midi skirt and some little heel boots as well. Something like that for like, I don't know, like a date night or um, any sorts of occasions at this time of year. I feel like sometimes like chunky knits and big roll necks and things can actually get a bit hot or a bit toasty in them. At this time of year, I'm actually really hot in this film and this now. And this is like a proper fluffy knit um, jumper. So yeah, I absolutely love this. It's actually really reasonably priced. It's 19.99 and I had 20% off for downloading the app when I ordered. So it was only 16 pound, which I think is so, there's so much detail going on for that price. I am over the moon with it. And I haven't top shop, shopped in Topshop for a little while. So I was pleasantly surprised with the pieces when they arrived. Next, I'm gonna talk about this blazer. So this was an absolute dream. I just saw the color and you'll see by this haul today that I've been a little bit brown obsessed recently. Anything that's brown, I've been like, pop it in my basket, pop it in my basket. I just think it's a nice alternative to black. It also goes really well with black. And it's just like a little bit more chic. No, you can't be more chic than black, I take that back. But it's just something refreshing. It's just something new from black. Um, but it will never replace black. But I do love it. Um, and it, this has just got gorgeous colours in. I think the colours in this are an absolute autumnal and wintry dream. This is um, £59.99 and you can roll the sleeves up. So you could either wear this like open as a blazer. You could probably take this off if you're going to do that, I would say. Um, or you can wear it like tied up. Um, and I think this would look really great in the cutaway. I think I paired it with some... Um, 
some black faux leather leggings um, and then some heel boots from Topshop which I'll talk to you about in a minute but I actually think it would look, also look really great with biker boots. Now it might come to a surprise to you guys that I actually do really enjoy wearing biker boots because they're like the least girly thing ever but I think they just like give a little bit of chic or a bit of edge to an outfit. Sometimes you could be wearing like the most chic outfit with a pair of biker boots on or you could just pop them on with a leather jacket and they look great. I feel like my nose has gone really red. <laughs> That's how I know I'm hot because my nose goes really red. I'm like Rudolph. It's not Christmas yet, Katie. Um, so I do apologize if it's very red, but anyway, it's just life. I'm just keeping the real vibes going over here with my red nose. Um, so yeah, I love this. I think it's super chic. It's very classy. This one was a little bit big, so maybe consider sizing down. My top is my smaller half, but I still think I am a 12 on the top generally so maybe size down on this one um but yeah really lovely piece and be really really great and like nice and chic to wear at this time of year as well so if you've got lots of occasions if you want to go christmas shopping those kind of things really really nice and just a gorgeous easy easy outfit if they have this dreamy heavy jumper this is so gorgeous as well this is 35.99 so a little bit more pricey but you can feel the quality in this and like how heavy it is I obviously love the frill detail on this. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a really like thick knitted jumper. So it doesn't look knitted to look at. Oh my God, it's a dream on. I absolutely love this one. When I got it out of the bag, I was like, this is just a bit of me. The sleeves are like slightly bigger and then they come in at the ends and I just love it. I think it's just gonna look great with jeans and black boots um, or just tucked into like again, a midi skirt or a maxi skirt, something like that. Um, but just super easy to wear and you can also again wear it around the house with your joggers and you just look a little bit more chic that kind of thing so next i'm going to talk to you about this jumper dress now if you've seen one of my quiz hauls recently um, i had a jumper dress very similar to this in the quiz haul um literally looks almost exactly the same the only thing i would say is different is this is a little shade lighter and the other one's more of like a camely color whereas this one's more of like a sand this one's a little bit softer as well whereas the other one's more of like um a stiffer knit if that makes sense but also i would say the other one has like a nice chunky roll neck and this one i felt like the neck was just a bit like it didn't really know what it wanted to do it looks like it wants to hold up but it kept like slouching down so i'm not sure if that's just because it was a little bit big it's size large um, but I guess I was going for like the oversized dress, chunky knit sort of like look. It's a lovely length, this one though. Um, just paired with some over the knee boots, high knee boots, or even some little ankle boots, um, depending on what you feel most comfortable in. I always think you can wear a jumper dress as well with a pair of trainers. It looks really cute. Nice teddy jacket or something like that over the top. Really cute and cosy. Um, I also think it would look lovely with like a big belt cinched in at the waist. I'm actually, I've got my eye out at the minute for a nice waisted belt put over these kind of dresses so if anyone's got any recommendations leave them down below for me if not i will hopefully have found one soon and share it over my instagram so make sure you are follow me over there i'm at with love katie two underscores um yeah i really love this it's a little bit more pricey it's 45.99 but it does it does feel so soft and the quality oh and the quality of it feels really sort of like almost um like cashmere it's that it's gen generally that soft so it is a very nicely made jumper dress and also like just at this time of year is jumper dress not just the best thing i feel like i could live in a jumper dress because i feel like they're just comfy they're chic that's all i care about comfy and chic <laughs> everything else has got the window so this skirt i actually paired with the first jumper that i shared with you guys that little black um really cute collared top i got this skirt in a large and again it fit nice it was more on the big side though than the small side so i would say this is more of a 12 to 14 so maybe if you're a 10 to 12 go down to the medium i think i would have been a bit better with the medium um only around the waist everywhere else was fine the waist was just a little bit big for me but i think it's an absolutely lovely midi dress it's that skirt it's 29.99 um and then it's got quite a like a quite a high split at the side so i think this is going to be lovely for every day with a nice chunky jumper like tucked in or you could definitely wear this dress set for an evening with a lovely blouse and some heels or a lovely blouse and i don't know some heeled boots that kind of thing it's going to be very versatile i've actually picked up one of these in gray and i wore it when i was filming my last zara haul and so many of you guys were like where's that skirt from because they like literally it's just such a lovely skirt um, and this is very similar and reminds me of it and um, this is just probably the split is a little bit higher and I feel like this may be just like a slightly different material. This is a bit more ribbed. I don't think the other one is ribbed. 
can't think right now off the top of my head. You'll have to go and watch the Zara haul to see. Um, I'll leave that link down below for you guys. It's a really good Zara haul. There's some lovely finds in there. Um, but yeah, I love this skirt and I think these kind of things are so versatile. Um, I feel like I love skirts at this time of year. They're just great with boots. Um, they also look great with trainers for like a more relaxed day look. But if you're more classy and you prefer, not that you're not classy if you wear trainers, but if you prefer a more classy look, um, then I think boots are that little bit more classy. And I think you can also wear these, which looks great, with some high knee boots. Um, so yeah, I really, really love that skirt. And I think it's a great price as well, to be honest, for the thickness, the quality, and how often you'll wear it probably, because you'll be surprised if you don't have a piece like this. Honestly, it would look really great with this cropped jumper that I've got on now as well. And then like a little pair of boots. Like such an easy every day. Next I'm going to go into this because I feel like it's staring at me. Um, this was actually the piece that inspired this whole haul. So I went on, I downloaded the app, used the 20% off to get this. And then I ended up with all that. So this is what inspired the haul today. So this is like this gorgeous chocolatey brown crop. And I, I had something like this again in the Zara haul. So it was like a soft knit crop with a cardi over. And they do come separately. Um, so the... Cardi is $29.99, but I have to say the Zara ones were like $5.99 and $9.99. They were so reasonable. Um, and this bralette is $22.99, so a lot more pricey than the Zara one. However, the Zara one's probably already out of stock because that's what happens on Zara. Um, but this is, yeah, it's, it's just, it's completely different. This is a lot thicker um, material, and this is like a body, body, body. Uh, I was saying I don't know how wearable this is in comparison with the Zara one. Um, but I do think it's lovely and I do think it'd be really great for this time of year. It's like a really, it's more of like a chocolatey wine colour. It is really lovely though, I really really like that one. Um, and I like the cardigan on top, which I feel like you could easily wear with other things as well. Um, so really nice, really versatile um, jumper. But I do think the jumper will probably be more wearable than the bralette because I feel like this, this like without straps, they are a bit annoying aren't they? And you're like yanking them up all the time. Um, so yeah, for me, probably won't keep this one if I'm honest but I do think it'd be lovely for like a Christmas occasion and um, spending time with family those sorts of things because it just looks really chic and you could just easily wear like a pair of jeans with this you don't have to dress it up like I did in the cutaway I dressed it up with a pretty funky skirt which we'll get on to in a bit um but yeah this could be easily worn with so many different things to, for different sorts of occasions um so it's not just a dressy look you could even wear these kind of things around the house but I feel like it's a bit extra. <laughs> As you will see, there's a bit of a brown theme in this haul, but how expensive does this bag look? Oh my God, it's 22 99 And I had obviously, again, 20% off. I just feel like this looks so expensive. I feel like this looks like a proper designer handbag. Um, it feels gorgeous as well, which I always think is really important. Um, it's got this lovely zip along the front. It's got these really cute two little gold bits for the open and closer what's it called <laughs> i can't even think it's just a really nice structured bag um i think it's going to be really nice for like everyday looks um that's just a super classy everyday handbag i also have another brand which i feel like i may as well show you while i'm chatting to you about handbags which is this one um which i actually love as well again chocolate color a bit inspired by the brown i've just i don't know what it is at the moment i'm obsessed with brown um, this one is again 22 99 and it's got a lovely thick zip here. This again is like a nice everyday one. But this one probably could be worn for like more an evening as well. I love the structure of this bag. It's just like thin and lovely and really easy to just pop with the shoulder or just under the arm. Just easy to style with so many different outfits. Just makes everything look a little bit more chic. And like I said, it's just a little bit of a change from the black. So I feel like you'd probably be surprised how easy it is to style a bag like this with a lot of outfits it goes a lot with like creams neutral colors um whites blacks and obviously brown actually i think it would look really nice like a khaki as well but on accessories i'm going to talk to you about these boots so these are a really really classy pair of like classic black boots i talk about classic black, black boots a lot in here but i just feel like they're such a staple to my wardrobe and i just love having a look at the different ones from different stores and um, picking sort of like my favorite ones and these are absolutely dreamy the heel on these i have to just say look at that heel it is it's a beautiful heel like if I've ever seen a more beautiful heel than that, I don't actually know. I think that is such a lovely, chunky, wearable heel. It's kind of high, but 
it's like the highest I would possibly go. I think the fact that they've got no zip makes them look really expensive. Um, they're just a really gorgeous classic classy boot and then they've gone like a bit pointy and then squared off the toe which I really love. I think these look great. I'm not sure if you guys have got into them yet but there are some really dreamy like flared jeans around. Yes, believe me when I say that, flared jeans. But I've got some really great ones from River Island. I don't know if there's a picture of them on my Instagram just yet. Is there? I don't think there is, but there may be by the time you watch this video. So yeah, I absolutely love them. I think they're great. They are £65, but I think they are real leather, so you're paying a little bit more for your money. Are they real leather? Yes, they are real leather. Also, these were quite snug, so for my wide fit girls, um, I'm wide fit. These aren't wide fit. Maybe, maybe leave these, if I'm honest. Um, maybe look if they have a wide fit alternative at the time i think they didn't but maybe they will now so yeah have a little look but if they if i find a wide fit alternative when i'm doing the links i will put them down there for you guys so let's talk about this little skirt shall we so this is like a croc berry maroon burgundy how many how many words can i use to describe this skirt skirt basically it's 35.99 i got it in the size 12 i do find top shop skirts always a little bit snug i have to be honest it was a little bit snug around the hips um i do like it i'm not going to keep it because i just cannot see myself wearing it enough to warrant it i felt like the split was quite high i felt like it was going to be a little bit like oh i would be conscious if i was wearing it but i think that's because i'm tall so shorter girls i feel like you'll be fine with this and you can pull off midi skirts don't feel like you can't just because you're shorter you 100 percent can and i think it is just a gorgeous different skirt this would also be really nice paired with like some chunky trainers nice chunky jumper really casual for the day um obviously in the cutaway i've paired it with the little crop and the little body cropped cardigan and cropped body um but yeah i do think it'd be a versatile piece in the sense that you could wear it for the day as well like that next a little basic so a little white cropped hoodie i feel like little basics like this this time of year are just great loungewear obviously at the minute as well we're wearing a lot of because we are at home a lot more especially if you're in the uk we're still on like we're not on a lockdown in wales but england are so this is 32.99 so a little bit more pricey for some loungewear but um it is a size medium and i feel like it's a bit of a classic piece it's a nice cropped one you could also wear this to the gym um that, so you could get a little bit more wear out of it you could even wear it with a pair of jeans and a pair of trainers to wear it more like of a casual day look um for those days you just don't feel like dressing up but you still want to look nice i don't know if i do think that's a little bit expensive for just a crop jumper i feel like you could probably get similar from elsewhere but i do think if you've got the money in it's not an issue and then maybe there's a sale on go for it because it's nice quality um there's not really much more to say about that one a little bit more loungy wear so this is this is probably the nicest colored um I've, so I've been looking for loungewear in this colour for a long time and I have noticed like from the other some other online retailers that when it comes the colour's so varied than what it is online um however this is actually the nicest colour so I'd say it's more like a mocha whereas some of the other ones I've seen have been like they look like shitty colours they're just like they're just not like muddy dirty off colours if that makes sense or like they just look cheap basically and this i think is the nicest color um it is quite big this is a medium i think it was oversized because it, like you can see it is big so i possibly will probably go down to a small in this maybe even extra small i don't know this is 29.99 so again i do think it's a little bit more pricey but i it is very soft and I do feel like it will last you a long time. So if you're looking to update your loungewear, maybe pop it on a Christmas list or something like that. Um, because it is, and probably will be in the sale. And it is a really lovely colour. And I've been looking for a loungewear this colour for a long time. But yeah, I would have to go down to a different size. Because it was just a little bit too big. It felt like I was wearing like one of Reese's hoodies. Which sometimes is nice, but it makes it then like less wearable, I think, for out of the house. And if you want something you can wear in and out of the house, I think getting it to fit a little bit nicer. But still comfy is more ideal. So then I also got some trousers that matched that. And these again were a little bit big. These were a medium. And they were big. They're £32.99, which I just think that's quite a lot for loungewear. It, they are really soft on the inside, I have to say. The quality of the inside, um, compared to a lot that I've tried on recently, because I've been trying a lot of loungewear on this year, um, they are a lot softer. They're a lovely material, 
Um, and they do feel good quality, but I do think that is the highest I would ever pay for like some joggers, to be honest. I'm more of like a 10 pound in Primark kind of girl when it comes to joggers, because I just think most of the time, like you're the only one that's gonna see them. But if you are gonna go for a pair that you wanna wear out of the house, if joggers are your thing, you know, when you wear like joggers and those cool caps, like I'm not that cool, but if that's you, I'd probably be surprised if anyone that's that cool is watching my channel. <laughs> but <laughs> if you are, cool if you're not they are a lovely snuggly pair like i say if, if if money isn't an issue go ahead and pay 32.99 for some joggers but not saying money is an issue i just think i'm quite mindful and quite sensible of like what you need to spend money on and what you don't but then i have said that and then i've got some loungewear that i bought that was cheap and it doesn't last so who knows pros and cons to both um, and then those loungewear sets are paired with these really lush chunky trainers i love these more so because of the neutral little added tones on them. I think it just looks great um, added with some neutral loungewear like that and then on the laces as well. These are just gorgeous, simple, white, chunky trainers. I feel like I wear white, chunky trainers so much recently. So, so much. These are £32. I won't be keeping these because I have so many pairs that are so similar. Um, but I do love them and I do think they're a good price. They're a nice, chunky trainer that doesn't... They don't look cheap. I feel like chunky trainers can sometimes easily look cheap. Um, I do have a few pairs I think I've shared over on my Instagram and a lot of previous hauls so yeah these are lovely but I have shared a lot of nice chunky trainers in the past. These are probably one of the nicest, these are definitely nicer than the H&M ones I had two or three weeks ago. Um, so yeah in case you couldn't guess by me rambling then I do really like those. These, oh my god, these are so cool. If my best friend Lizette is watching this she's, she's gonna be all over these although she doesn't like it too high a heel, so I'm not sure if she'll be all over the heel. But these, maybe they're a bit too pointy for her as well. <laughs> but I feel like she'll appreciate the metallic if she's watching. She better give this some thumbs up and she better bloody left me a comment. Otherwise our best friendship is over, love. <laughs> um, these are just wow, aren't they? They're so cool. They're so like funky. They're different. They're definitely going to dress up like an all black outfit. Great lovely with like an all black dress maybe like um, a chunky knitted dress dress it up literally you can wear these so many ways i think they're so cool they're 39.99 so they're not even too expensive um i just think they're great they're like a bronzy color metallic bronze very me but they are very high and yeah this kind of heel height becomes an issue also my wide fit girls they're not very forgiving on the width so just bear that in mind depending on how wide fit you are um they're called honey which i just like makes me love them even more but i think they're really cool um yeah they could be worn a number of ways um but i would say they're more for like great little events at this time of year and that kind of thing um popping out to like see the girls for a little like Christmas drink or something like that. They're gonna be quite like catching of the eye. And next I picked up this. Okay, it probably was inspired by like Emily in Paris, but I have always really liked these little berets, I have to be honest, but I'm really annoyed they put the ticket on the front. So like when you try it on, it's really hard to see like what it would actually look like. Well, I look like I've got a loaf of bread on my head right now. <laughs> because of the ticket like it's just so badly poorly placed um i don't feel like i'm putting it on right but anyway i really like this surprisingly i'm losing my voice i filmed five videos in the last two days my voice is literally about to give up on me i feel five or six a lot anyway um wow i've not lost my voice in a long time um, yeah i don't know how much this is because there's no price on it but i'm feeling like it was under 20 quid um they do have some of these as well in pre-mark for four pound um that i noticed last time i was in there it's not as nice a color but it is it is nice if it's just something you wanted to try and then maybe get a nicer one in but i do think this was like quite reasonable anyway so i'll pop the link down below as i will with all the other links to the video um that i've shared things that i've shared with you next i'm going to talk about this little scarf this is just like a gorgeous little scarf and this is inspired by a scarf from my last haul um which was my Zara haul and there was a lovely one in there with all these sorts of colours in as well. However, I do prefer that one than I than I do this one. Um, this for me is like, kind of reminds me of like the ones that guys wear. But I do kind of like it at the same time. It's a little bit beery-esque. 
but also a little bit, I don't know, there's just something not quite right with it for me. It's got like greys and beiges in, which is what I liked about it, because it sort of blends with both colours then, uh, which means it's more versatile. However, I do prefer the, the Zara one that did the same. It's 17 99 the Zara one was 19 99 I actually picked up one in Primark as well, it was so similar, um, which was £4, so take your pick. Um, but I do think something like that is really nice to have different colours and you can add it into like a grey jacket, I pop it on top of like a cream beige jacket, obviously a white one, a black one, very very versatile. Then next thing I've got to share with you is this jumper dress, I got this in a size medium, when I put it on a hanger I was like whoa that is going to be short which is probably why in the cutaway I did show it to you with some like um, black, black faux leather leggings. Um, however, when I took them off, I didn't actually need them. So then I did show you again with them off because you don't actually need them. Um, but I do think it's nice to show that as an alternative because some people don't feel comfortable getting their legs out. Obviously, you could also wear tights. Um, however, I do feel like you should just embrace just embrace what you got. You've got it, flaunt it. Don't even worry about it. Like, don't even ever feel self conscious about yourself because you don't need to. Like, you shouldn't feel self conscious about yourself. I feel like people say, like, oh, it's just easy to say, but. If you wish, like everyone can, I'm not special, and everyone can find that happiness within their bodies and within their themselves and how they feel about themselves, even if that seems so unrealistic and so far away right now, you actually can. Like it just takes some mindset work um, and some work on yourself. Like spend some time to, to look after yourself because at the end of the day, the relationship you have with yourself is the longest relationship you'll ever be in. Like you'll be with yourself and your thoughts for the rest of your life so it's definitely worth spending some time reading some self-help books um like reaching out to people who are in a good headspace maybe with their the way they feel about their bodies um maybe if you're unhappy with yourself for for a certain reason look at what where that's come from like is it stemmed from a childhood belief or something like that i'm going way off topic now but i do this is something i'm really passionate about because it's been a whole process and a whole journey for me as well um i have got a whole story on basically the about oh my god it's a long story basically that's why i'm like gibbering because for about 10 years I'd say I had like really disordered eating, I really wasn't happy with my body, my shape and I just thought for the rest of my life I'll be on a diet and unhappy with my body. And then like 10 years, 10 years of that and then 4 years of working on myself, yes 4 years but it's going to be worth it for the rest of my life. I'm now in a really happy place, I'm now really comfortable with my body, I'm really comfortable with the way I eat, the way I exercise, it's completely shifted, I don't exercise because I hate my body, I exercise because I love my body, I eat what I want and I really enjoy it and I eat healthily as well because I really enjoy healthy foods but I have just a great balance with food, like I want to have a pizza night, I don't feel guilty and I do it, so, and there's no guilt, and I mean that, no guilt. Um, I don't cut calories, don't weigh myself, all that, but we'll, we'll get, we'll go off track here. If that's a separate video you guys want to hear more on, then just definitely leave me a comment down below, um, and I'd be more than happy to, like, talk about that in more detail, um, because it is, yeah, like I said, a huge journey, and I do have a video about my journey through those 10 years, so if that's something you want to, I'll leave a link down below. Um, but yeah, this jumper dress is just gorgeous, it's great again, and it would look great with, like, a nice belt again around the waist if you wanted to just cinch it around the waist but if you just want something that's comfy jumper dresses are just that easy everyday thing that I just love and reach for so often and um, I feel like you just need one in like a nice light colour and then a black or a darker colour, a nice grey and um, I've got a lovely one from New Look actually in a grey which should be on my Instagram by the time you watch this so if it is I'll pop it here. Um, it's great, it's just so comfy, it's perfect length, shape, size, it just fits great, it's so snuggly and I feel like they're just Oh, you know we just don't want anything to touch you. That's what a jumper dress is the best thing for. But you still look nice. Um, and then again, you can pair these with like chunky boots, high knee boots, over the knee boots, trainers, um, what are they called? Biker boots, all sorts of things. Like there's so many ways to wear a, a knitted dress like this. So you don't feel like it's gonna be limiting at all. This is 39.99 and like I said, it's in a medium, it's quite wide plenty of room in it and it's just it fit really nice it's a nice color as well it's got like a sort of speck of gray through but it is a creamy color and i really like this it's quite different i feel like my mum will like this if she's watching this by herself and then on to the last piece that we've got today i think i feel like i've talked your ears off this has been a little bit of a long one 
Um, next, this last piece is just this lovely, soft, really thin knit um, jumper. This is gonna be great for like every day, round the house, tucked into some joggers, but also would look great just tucked into jeans when you're popping out um, with, again, some little, nice little heeled boots or a little um, trainer. Really, really easy to wear. It's lovely, soft material. It's so reasonable as well. It's $15.99. It's a really great shape. I feel like it's very, very flattering. I always feel like jumpers that just share the collarbone. I feel like they're just a little bit more flattering. I don't know what it is. Very feminine, very girly. Which is obviously home and in the kitchen making some noise. Eating some mince pies. I see you. I spy you scoffing a mince pie. This boy, honestly. I don't know how many mince pies you've eaten already and it's not even December. 40. 40. No shame. <laughs> but like I said earlier, you don't need to have any shame around your food, but that is a bit crazy. Um, so yeah, this is really lovely, just like every day. 15.99, I feel like it's so reasonable and the quality does feel great. I also forgot to talk to you guys about this one that I'm wearing right now. So it's this really gorgeous, snuggly, cropped, um, like tie up cardi I love this uh, clearly I love it because I've got it on and I just think it's such a dream like look how soft and snuggly that is I don't know if you can see how snuggly it is but it really really is and um, I think it's really reasonable as well and um yeah I just think it's really really nice perfect again for like those evenings where you want to be a bit snuggly or perfect for like dressing up with a pair of like high-waisted jeans some flared jeans if you're feeling them, um, some mom jeans, some skinny jeans, whatever your vibe of jean is, but I do think like a nice high waist would look really cute with obviously it because it's cropped. Um, and yeah, that's everything from today's video, you guys. I really hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit that, that, hit that thumbs up button. Make sure you've hit subscribe for all those good vibes and make sure you have the alarm bell button on not to miss any more videos and not to miss any of Vlogmas because you guys, it's gonna be good gonna be fun this year there's so much so much exciting stuff uh, we filmed putting the tree up i filmed making some potpourri already um so some homemade potpourri which is let me tell you it's dream um what else have we filmed making the christmas cake um we've filmed so much already ready for christmas but there's going to be so much more lots of nice weekly vlogs things that we get up to around christmas and yeah i'm really excited to share all that with you so i hope that you will stick around for that like I, like always leave me a comment of your favorite down below in the comments section and all the links from today's video will be down below in the description box as well as any other videos that i've mentioned throughout this haul and also my instagram if you're not following me over there i'm at with love katie and two underscores like i said i share daily fashion info over there so make sure you are over there as well um to get all the fashion inspo and now i'm done i can't speak anymore so have a lovely afternoon evening or morning whenever you watch this and i'll hopefully see you in the next video bye for now Deck the halls with boughs of holly